Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do placement parameters. I'm going to use Canyon as an example, but the same principle applies to every environment. So this is the item that we're wanting to create. And so let's get started. What I'm going to do is go into item mode. I'm going to create a block based on, uh, create an item based on this block. I'm going to go into Mesh Modeler, and I'll just select the top, change the surface to grass. I'm going to save it. I'm say uh, platform grass two. The back all the way out. And you'll see that the, the, the placement parameters are very open. You can do whatever you want with it. And for some people, they like that freedom. But I like, I like items to be able to be placed right within the grid. So what we're going to do is we're going to place it. I'm going to go into Edit the Item. And I'm going to go Pivot Position. I'm going to change that. You'll notice by default it's here at the corner. I like it to be in the center of the block. So blocks in Canyon are 64 by 64. So we're going to change these parameters to uh, 32 and 32. You'll see that the blue dot is now in the center. And I'm going to go ahead and raise it to the top of the block. So blocks in Canyon are 16 meters. The block space is actually 16 meters tall. So we'll go 16. Now you'll see the blue dot there, the pivot position is at the center of the block. Now we'll go into placement parameters. We want to change fly step and grid vertical size. Change both of those to 16, so that's the full block space. So when you scroll up and down to move the block um, up and down, it'll move an entire block space, which is what we want. Then the grid horizontal size we're going to change this to 64. That way it'll move an entire block space when we move it over. Now, if we only change those parameters, watch what happens. I'm going to delete this one. You can see that uh, it's not in the correct position. It's not within the, within the uh, correct area of the grid. That's because we have the pivot position set right in the center of the block and it's moving an entire block space. So what we need to do to fix that, is we need to go back in here and change the grid horizontal offset. We're gonna do change that to 32, and that'll offset it by 32 and fix that. And now it's placed correctly within the grid. And if we scroll up and down, you can see it scrolls an entire block space as it should. So that's that's how you do it in uh, Canyon. If you want to see how to do it in uh, Stadium, I'll quickly jump over there. Okay, so now we're in Stadium. Now the uh, block sizes are actually smaller. Um, this applies to Valley, Stadium, and Lagoon. So I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing, create a block based on this platform block. And, um, I don't know. Yeah, well, I'll just make this one grass as well. So the same thing. And by the way, if you scroll, it doesn't go a whole block space. Same thing was true in Canyon, which I didn't really show. Um, so if we want to set that up, what we're going to do is do the pivot position first. But um, instead of 32, which is half of 64, we're going to do 16 because the full block width is 32. So we're going to go half of that. It's going to move the, this blue dot over to the center. 16 here as well. Now it's in the center. Now if we wanted to raise it to the top, we would go 8. So now it's at the top. You can also leave this blue dot at the at the bottom of the block. So that's also that also works. 
So we'll go back into placement parameters, and instead of 16, we're going to do 8. And 8 for the vertical grid size. That's so that it would go up an one block space. These blocks are 8 meters tall. And then we'll do the um, grid horizontal size 32 because the block space is 32. And so we want it to, to, to move 32 meters at a time. Now the same thing would happen if we save this. It's going to be offset. So we need to actually uh, create an offset so that it fits within the grid. But in, So we'll go 16, which is half. Save it again. And now it fits within the, uh, the block space. And uh, yeah, that's all there is to it. I uh, hope that helps. Have fun.